Hello everybody, I hope this finds you well. I'm going to talk today as I usually do about our COVID numbers and our vaccination progress. I'm going to touch briefly on our strategy development work and then also just say a few words about International Workers Memorial Day which we marked yesterday. So starting off first of all, if I can just say a few things about the numbers. Um, the number of new cases yesterday reported were 27 in Lanarkshire and we now only have 14 inpatients across the three sites, so that has come down markedly um, over the last couple of weeks. Uh, one patient still in ICU and one outbreak in care homes. We did, as I told you last week, get down to zero, but we have now got one cluster again. Um, in terms of our Gold Command, we are stepping that down and moving across to business as usual. So less Gold Command meetings and more normal meetings happening now in Kirklands and also across the sites and community services and our IGBs. Um, in terms of vaccination delivery, the number of individuals we vaccinated sits at 359,000 and 492 doses, 492,000 doses administered and the difference between those two is obviously the second doses. The number of first doses has stayed quite similar for the last few days, even though we're doing between six and 7,000 doses a day and that's because we're focusing on second doses at the moment. Next week we'll move into cohort 10, which is 40 to 49 year olds. So if you've got friends and family in that bracket, they will be invited for vaccination. Uh, soon and we'll be receiving those blue envelopes through their posts so please encourage everybody uh, that you know to take up the vaccination. I did go out to Ravens Craig this week and uh, now that I'm allowed to and saw that in action and was hugely impressed by the team working in that unit um, very slick uh, and running like clockwork. I know we've had our ups and downs and some days we have had issues around workforce uh, or supplies of vaccine but the day I went which was Monday it was all working very well and I think generally it does work well so thanks again to all the staff involved in the vaccination. If I can talk briefly about our refresh strategy we're beginning to have a look at um, I've not got a name for it yet, but we, we want to refresh Achieving Excellence and have a new strategy for NHS Lanarkshire, um, working also with our partners, so there'll be Lanarkshire-wide elements to that, and particularly the elements around addressing health inequalities, which I think will be hugely important for us, particularly as we start to come out of COVID. Um, so there'll be the clinical elements to the strategy and also the wider piece, working with partnership organisations, and we've already embarked on that work. So quite excited about getting that kicked off. It's been a long time coming because we've been focused on COVID, but I think we really do need to focus on inequalities as we come out of the pandemic. So that work will be starting. And yesterday we took a minute of, of time at 12 o'clock midday. We joined together to recognise those people who have been injured, died or, or, or hurt and, or suffered ill health at work um, and just wanted to recognise their contribution. So that was International Workers Memorial Day and at, at this time we particularly obviously wanted uh, to remember Kirsty Jones and David Trower as part of that event yesterday and we joined with Unison colleagues um, and staff generally to, to mark that event yesterday as did staff all over all over the world actually not just in Scotland um, but right the way across the world. So I'll say goodbye and thank you for listening to me today. Thank you.